Let's see the mech one. Let's see the, <laughs> the magical girl one for a second. Yeah, I'm glad it didn't take me 20 tries to beat Kia. Three days after Project Turfing's last battle simulation, Reed made his way to the development site upon receiving an update from instructor Macro. I need to remember how to play this mini game as well. According to the instructor, we should be just about ready to go. Mint. Reen, what's up? Uncle Macro called you over, right? Yep, looks well, so like you already know what's going on. He, <laughs> that I do. I was asked to get some parts last time, but I didn't have the time. Now though, you won't be able to get rid of me. I'm done to get the show on the road. Wait for the others a bit before diving right in. Hey, Mint, we're here to give a wee bit of help. Wait, huh? People have been coming in and out here a lot these days. And just where are Professor Schmidt and his... Uh, sorry, just where are Professor Schmidt, Instructor Makarov and George? Yeah, I wonder what they're up to. What the? Hey, what's up, Reen? I thought you might be surprised. Definitely. This is the new model. Yep, drink it in. This here's the Turfing S, and it's all yours. Wait, what? Really? Sure is. The version, this version was tuned specifically to the data he provided from the last test. It's been modified to match all your habits and quirks. Downside being, it makes it nearly impossible for anyone else to pilot. But that also means you should find its output responsiveness to be better than any soldat you piloted before. A prototype tailored just for me. I don't even know what to say. What's the point of it? If you're gonna thank someone, you can start with me. I helped him make it. But I did make all... Sorry, I did almost delete all the data at one point, but let's not talk about that. Mint, I'm begging you to keep your hands away from the console from now on. So I'm guessing we'll be gathering more battle data. Yes, but you won't be sparing with myself or Fee this time, to be precise. In fact, I believe our guests should be just about done gearing up. I suppose this is the best we can do on such short notice. They better push these models to their limits, I'm expecting good data. Of course, I'm happy to help. Does Gaius even know how to pilot one? I mean, Crow... <laughs> Pattern C should have the best response. Crow had his own mech in the last game, so of course he should. Am I tuning it up uh, for a little indoor scrap? You've got it, just give me a sec. Wait, Gaius? Crow? Is Crow going to break a mech of his own? In the flesh. Good seeing you, by the way. You've also been helping with the turfing. I suppose that means we'll be opponents. Seriously, would a little warning have been too much to ask for? You could have at least said hi if you've been here the whole time. Sure about that. I just arrived back in town a little. My, uh, I just arrived back in town a little while ago myself. I've had to fly all over Arvonia lately as part of my responsibilities as a traveling priest. Well, that did allow me the opportunity to do some soldat training with Brigadier General Bardios the other day. I tried controlling it like I was riding a horse, but the Brigadier General defeated me easily. My unit ended up overheating. Something similar happened to you recently, from what I've heard. I think that's why I was invited to join the project. That makes sense. So I bet that also means you have a high ceiling. I can only imagine how good you'll be if Brigadier General Bardius uh, trained you. Maybe. This will be my first time fighting in the simulator, so go easy on me. I've only played- I've only used a mech once, and I broke it. That must mean I'm really good at it. I think you can guess why they asked me to join. Probably has something to do with me being Ordine's Awakener. That unit back there is the Turfing X, my very own custom model. So yours probably controls just as Ordine did. It should present a pretty tough challenge. But wait, it's not like they can throw together a custom unit like that in a few hours, right? You got me. Time to come clean. I've been skimming this for a while just to see the look on your face. Man, let me tell you, it hasn't been easy sneaking around here without your crow senses going off. It was totally worth it. We got you good! Yeah, I'll say. I never suspected a thing. Can't let your guard down around them. Maybe for keeping things under wraps. All that really matters, though, is that we collect data from two ex-awakeners to, uh, to help finish the turfing. So, how about it? Up for you getting your hands dirty again for the cause? But I've got some personal business to take care of in the near future, so I don't mind letting off a little steam beforehand. Let's get this party started, boys. Time to knock Project Turfing right on its ass. Yeah! Ready when you are. I hope you don't mind us spectating. I 
I need to remember the controls. <laughs> I'm trying to figure it out. No, so this is the naval fortress that got blown up. Uh, okay, there's the run. Oh, dodge. Oh, we can overheat it? I didn't realize that. Oh, fuck. That was a reload. Oh god, why did he dodge that way? Okay. I'm getting fucked up. I was just trying to remember how to how to move. Help. Yeah, I guess I should be more aggressive at uh, when it comes to killing specific mechs. Help. Oh, I pressed the wrong button. I'm gonna have to redo this one. I, I blame just not be not being used to the controllers anymore. Oh, it's gonna just die in one hit. What? That didn't that didn't connect. Ow. Please stop hitting me. Oh, wh where did you get behind me? Oh, right, you got a lock on, I forgot. Don't get close to me. Do you have to press the X button twice to pull the sword out? God, I have no help. This is gonna be a problem. God, they can shoot you from so far away. Oh, I need to redo this one. I'm bad! They restart the dialogue as well. Alright, it's time to be cheap, I guess. So I noticed they shooting me and I just decided to run away. Come on! I do find it upsetting that it shoots too, too high to hit the little buddy. Let me get behind you. Oh, these are just made to be killed that way. Everything else got. Uh, I got hit. I was working on a perfect. Okay, just two hits then. It might also be worth just shooting these ones. Seems like they have an aggro range before they actually start shooting you, huh? Oh no. Okay, at least they didn't one hit apparently. I didn't know this that before. I suddenly want to play Armored Core. <laughs> I 
ここで見せるとしよう<笑>それは楽しみだ全力で行くぞ Oh, can't I block as well? Oh, yeah, I can. It's just、uh, L1. I wonder how quickly he comes up instead of shielding. It seems I want to ask low. Low, do something. What you gonna do, guys? For a second, I thought it froze. The little mechs were harder. What the hell? Oh, I can't even reach. Fucker block. Oh, I accidentally activated high speed mode. <laughs> You fight just like Laura, huh? Pretty beat up actually. <laughs> oh, right, they give you item gotcha stuff. Wow, my palms are all sweaty from gripping the edge of my seat. I, sorry, I had so much trouble keeping the pun in. For the reference, same, that wasn't like any soldat fight I've ever seen before. Good job, boys. The date is excellent. I really owe ya. The final adjustments are going to be done in no time now. It's great. I'm glad we could help. It never feels good to take an L, but at least the data should be useful. I like to think the battle was beneficial for all of us. Hey, Mint, give me a hand with adjusting the actuator. We're gonna wrap this up and present today.、Uh, no time to waste. You got it, boss. Seems like they're finally in the home stretch. It's good to see. Well, we've come this far. We may as well pitch in、uh, to help with the finishing touches. I know such as. I guess. A few extra pairs of hands that never hurt anyone. Let us know if there's anywhere we could be of help, instructor. Don't mind if I do. I'm sort of I'm sort of pressed for time, so I'll take all the help I can get. Look about a group effort. I better lend a hand myself. It wasn't the same as piloting Valimar, but something did feel familiar about it. It made my eye itch. <laughs> It would seem you've gathered the last batch of data you need. It's about time. Yeah, things should be smooth sailing from here. I had a peek at the results. They look pretty promising. I can only imagine how impressive they'll be after the final adjustments. So, what do you think, Professor? Is this worthy of being instructor macro of Scapstone Project? I'm not the one who should be answering that. What do you think, Fit Schwarzer? Me? Well. I can't deny there's something special about piloting the turfing S. It's nothing like Valimar, but the controls still somehow felt familiar. It wasn't as if the turfing understood exactly what I was looking for in a soldat. If I had to sum it up in one evaluation, I would say that despite being incapable of moving on its own, 
The Drifting's precision is in executing its pilot's movements make it a great ally for any soldier or martial artist. A passing grade, in other words. I'd say so, yeah. Well, that's a relief. Apparently, Professor Schmidt was planning to use your feedback to decide whether it was an acceptable capstone project all along. Or? It would be foolish to ignore the input of a former Awakener. Developing a Panzer Soldat from scratch can take even a genius engineer two or more years. Makarov chose to ignore my first disciple's work and go it on its uh, go it on his own. This project was never about achieving a certain threshold of performance, but rather him demonstrating his abilities. He managed to complete the project without having to rely on Francis Legacy, the man who once overshadowed him. Or rather, he soon will. Makarov seems keen on keeping us waiting a few more hours for the final results. Does he know how busy I am? At least it sounds like he's already made up his mind to approve it. There you have it. All that's left now is lending a hand where he needs it and trying not to get in his way. What in the... What is that thing? Amazing! Did he develop a brand new model? He couldn't let us in on the fun, everyone just walked in on the, the secret floor. I can't believe you'd keep something like this a secret. I guess the cat's out of the bag now. I think that's for the best. I think I'll pitch him. Surfing S. Does the stand... Does the S stand for sexy? It's just as impressive against its pilot. Shut up. I heard something about it from the principal. That is beyond anything I'd imagined. I'm more interested in this terminal you've been using to crunch the data. A soldat simulator, eh? Sounds like a good time. Hands off the terminal! Quality kit's in here anyway. There's confidential property in here. Mint, whatever you do, don't you dare trip the power while we're backing up the data. They'll corrupt everything, got it? Step away from that power cord. Oh, come on, Uncle Makarov. I, even I'm not that clumsy. She says she does it. Isn't that the power button your finger's hovering over? You can't take your eyes off this girl. Yeah, get out! Get out! Get out! You're in the way! It's starting to feel like a party in here. Yeah, seriously. But hey, this is the Thor's way of doing things. Makarov officially presented his capstone project shortly after. Once it was given, Professor Schmidt gave his stamp of approval. Makarov hurried off, saying there was somewhere he had to be. That's the story for another day. Oh, he did have something about his wife being around. I completely forget who she was, though. Oh, no. The first time bonus item, Lion King. Is that the Rage Quartz, but better? I need to check that just in case.